if you want to hide and hide any column in this form, you can do that by the use of this hide and hide button. Like for example, this one. So you can check and check this one. If you want to unhide, you just click this button. So how to do this? Please watch this video until the end. So now let's start. Our sample is this customer table. So first thing to do is to click this one, create. We have to create a form, split, split form. So we have to choose this one, split form. And here we go. Let us close the navigation pin. This one also. So as you can see guys, this is movable. So we have to fix that. We have to make first a header. Okay, that one. And we have to put some colors. Okay. Now, we have to... Okay, that one. So to fix that, let's go to properties. We have to check this one first. No. Navigation button. No. The scroll bar should be neither. Okay. And what else? The split form, splitter bar should mean do. Okay. Let us say. Here we go. So it will not be moved. And we can adjust. So now let's put a command button to hide and hide this uh, particular columns. Example that one. So I have to click this one button. Let's cancel the wizard. Okay. Hide and hide. This one. And let's put some code. But don't worry, guys. This is only a macro so that it will be easy for you. It will be easy to the beginners to follow. So right click, properties, and in the event, let us click this one. On click, so let us click the macro. So choose run menu command. That one, and then unhide. Okay, that one, unhide columns. Click save. Only that um, command. So now. Let us see. So it's on the center. I have to um, check the anchoring. Should be in the top right. Okay. Try again. Okay. So when we click that one, hide. Okay. If you want to hide the customer ID, then so be it. The tax rate. Okay. If you want to unhide, okay. So that's it. I hope, guys, um, it helps you a lot. And if you are new to this channel and wants to learn more about Microsoft Access, please consider subscribing this channel. Once again, thank you and see you to my next video.